The House notes that the Koji Binway coalition, please. You are here by this band. Arms and light weapons is one of the major security challenges. Koji Binway coalition. Facing Nigeria, Africa, and indeed the world Onobu in general. Also notes that the trafficking. Onobu TJ. And why Can you resume your seat, please? Weapons, fuel, With your red cap. And gender, and gender um, political stability and post threats, not only to national security, but also to sustainable development. Further notes that the widespread proliferation and use of illicit small arms and light weapons by undesirable elements cuts across all geopolitical zones of the country and is contributing to the alarming levels of armed robbery, kidnapping, terrorism, and militancy that are ravaging the country. Concerned that the nation's borders have been porous and difficult to police over the years and the inability of the law enforcement agencies to check the supply of small arms and light weapons into Nigeria has worsened the security situation in the country. Resolves 2 one, urge the Inspector General of Police to activate the machinery of the Nigerian police force by evolving a mechanism to mop up large cash off small arms and light weapons in the hands of criminals. Two, also urge the Nigerian Immigration Service, the Nigerian Customs Service, and other relevant agencies to intensify efforts at tracking down and eliminating the sources of supply of those weapons as well as ensure adequate security at the borders. Three, further urge the executive arm of government to ensure that a frequently updated database of the weaponry, weaponry is maintained by the security agencies. And four, mandate the committees on police affairs and national security and intelligence to secure implementation, ensure implementation, and report back within eight weeks for further legislative action. I so move, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, so I'm from Abia State. Mr. Speaker, I rise to second the motion as moved by Honorable Linda, I so second. It's enormous. Mr. Speaker, it is, it is a challenge that must be approached in a holistic way. And if we don't do that, Mr. Speaker, Honorable Members, it's going to create a problem. The issue of um, the proliferation of small arms and light weapons in the country has actually risen to an enormous height. In fact, it's actually very unfortunate that it's, um, the facts Honorable available Samson. to us is that 70% of Chairman legal Airfus. weapons Chair in Airfus. Africa is actually Honorable domiciled. TJ. In, my, in Nigeria. So that Honorable is Hemby. definitely uh, a source of Chair concern business. For, uh, to us. And they also have, uh, have the Presidential uh, Committee on um, Small um, Arms and Light Weapons also saying to us that unfortunately that Nigeria is the choice country for all these illegal arms. So that shows, Mr. Speaker, that our borders are porous. And what, what are done with all these small arms and light weapons? They are all used to perpetrate uh, various forms of uh, criminality. Armed robbery, kidnapping, and of course the most heinous of all, all the crimes, terrorism. So we must address this situation, Mr. Speaker. We must have all the relevant agencies do their work, make sure that our borders are tightened up, make sure that all the areas that the smugglers are bringing in all these weapons are tightened up because Unfortunately, there's a high rate of crime in Nigeria. I can also speak about Onisha. This morning, I was, because I've gotten a lot of reports from my constituency, I spoke to my um, um, area commander who told me they are working very hard to address it. But the situation is, there are so, there are so many arms out there in the, hand, in, in the wrong hands. And until we start mopping up these arms, these light weapons that are in the wrong hands, there's going to be there's going to be continuous problem um, in Nigeria. There's going to be continuous security problem in Nigeria. Because what are these, well, what are these arms meant to uh, use for? It's meant, meant for a, a criminal act. So, Mr. Speaker, honorable members, I urge that we support this motion. Because what's the essence of motion? One of, one of, the, one of the goals of motion is to bring to the fore certain issues that maybe the executive arm don't consider very important. That's one, of the, that's one of the reasons why motions are brought on the floor of the House, and that's why uh, resolutions are, ta are, are taken on the floor of the House. So I urge members to please support this bill, 
because we really need to start bringing down the security challenges that we are facing due to all this, this proliferation of these small arms and weapons. Thank you so much, Mr. Speaker, honorable members. Honorable, those against it say name. Ayes have it.